No life matters. Greetings, my human friends. This is Rudolf of Germany, the tall white alien. And yes, after all these discussions which go around the world about black life matters, all life matters, animal life matters, I want to give you the perspective from the viewpoint of the tall white alien race. We are of the opinion and conviction that no life matters. And here is why. A few examples as you used to hear from me to make things clear. And if you Ponder it. Think it over. You might even get in to the position of understanding our viewpoint. Why does life not matter? First of all, just imagine a president of a powerful country decides with his cabinet we are going to bomb another country and we start with putting a nuclear bomb on a very large city over there just to drive home a point. They decided the pilot is flying over the city and he is dropping the bomb just at target. In a matter of three, four or five seconds, the entire population of this town is being killed. One million people, black people, white people, Asian people, children, women, men, animals, dogs, cats, horses, mosquitoes, trees, flowers. All of it is dead in a matter of seconds. Does life matter to the politicians who decided after long discussions to kill one million people? Certainly not. So life don't matter to these people. Does life matter to the pilot and the crew on the airplane who know they are going to fly somewhere and bomb one million people? to death? Certainly not. Otherwise they wouldn't have boarded the airplane to begin with. So life does not matter to them. Now, ultimately, does life matter to the people who got killed, to the one million humans, animals and plants in this particular city? Does life matter to them? Certainly not. They don't even have a chance to even think about it, if it matters or not. Because if something matters or don't, relies on the ability to think about it and make a decision about it. And they can't. Life does not matter to them. Neither to the ones who take it, nor to the ones whose lives have been taken. This is very important to understand. Life does not matter. In a universal sense, if all life on all planets in this universe would come to an end from one moment to the next, and there is in the entire universe not one being which can think about life in general and life in the context if it matters or not. If all life in the universe is destroyed at once, there you will see that there is nobody even to think about if life matters or not. And there is no way of ever telling if there has been life in the past, in the present, or if there will be life in the future. Since life depends on the mental abilities 
of living creatures. And if there are no living creatures, there is no way of even thinking about life. So life only matters in the context of a reflection of intellectual beings. If a being can think, they have the ability once in a while to also think about the value of life. But once this thinking ability has been taken, there is no way of putting value on life at all. And once life altogether ceases, there is no way of even making any kind of assessment of value or anything else. So life does not matter only for the ones who are inclined to think about it. But just because there is no importance in life does not mean we should not enjoy it. Every single day you should enjoy moments of happiness in life and also respect the right of others, no matter what color they are, no matter what age or gender they are. All of you out there should have the possibility in this short lifespan to have as many beautiful moments in life as possible. Because if there is anything in life which matters, it's the moments of happiness and love. Rudolf of Germany.